Let's now focus on the election of MMDC's and President Tekufado's nominee for the Elembe-led district, Kwesi Bonzo, has been rejected by the Assembly. Some Assembly members expressed disquiet about the exercise, accusing colleagues of holding the development of the district to ransom. The Alambala district was viewed as one of those where the nominee would face a Achillean task on his endorsement. Kwesi Bonzo was not among the three persons shortlisted by the voting committee. He was self-nominated, much to the delight of many, as some traditional leaders lauded the decision of the president at the news conference. Before voting, the membership of four government-appointed assembly members were revoked. But this was challenged by some other assembly members. After close one hour, the decision was accepted. At the end of voting, the nominee, Kwesi Bonzo, was rejected. We had three rejected ballots. 22 voted no. 27 voted yes. The nominee obtained more than 50%. So what it means is that within 10 days, the assembly will call us, we will come back again. Western Regional Minister Kwabnotri Dako Mensah in an interview described the results as unfortunate. We are happy also that they didn't reject him outside. At least they give him a second chance to come back. And we'll come back. Earlier, the Member of Parliament for Lembele, Emmanuel Amakofibua, had admonished the Assembly members to be guided by the interest of the district in their voting. Whoever becomes DC, I do everything possible to make sure I have a working relationship with that person. Because in the final analysis, no, we cannot follow our party and personal interests and basically let the development of our district suffer. The Assembly will in 10 days reconvene to vote again. Well, in Nabdam and the Upper East region, a misunderstanding ensued between members of the NPP after the president's nominee, Agnes Anamu, failed to get the nod. So she polled 12 out of the 19 votes, representing 63.1%. She is one of the DCEs to have been retained by the president, having already served a four-year term. The NPP regional chairman, who hails from the district, was accused of influencing the government-appointed assembly members not to confirm the nominee.